fishing films. Today we're gonna to be building a 3D printed fishing lure. Some other YouTubers have done this and since we have a 3D printer, we were gonna think we could make our own and try it out. So right now we're gonna start 3D printing the lure. We'll insert some clips of it being printed and then we're gonna to get to making it and then we're gonna to get to fishing it. So hope you guys enjoy. Right now we are putting it together with all the hooks, weights, um, rattles, everything else you know you'd want in a lure. You probably saw some of it being printed earlier, so we are gonna build it right now and take it fishing really soon. And so this is the final product right here. It is um, gonna. It's kind of a. It's supposed to be like a spook. It's a little wide, not, it's not super proportional. But it's the first one we made. We actually might actually sell some fishing lures. So if you're interested in that, comment down below. Um, we would make soft plastic and hard baits. We actually engraved fishing films into it right here. We're gonna touch up some more glue on it just to seal it more, and then we are going to spray paint it, and then we're gonna take it fishing. We're gonna spray paint it right now. Got some chrome spray paint, just you know, give it some shiny, and we're just gonna spray paint it, and we're gonna see how it turns out. This is a 3D lure fin finished finished um, model. Um, so as you can see, you know, it's a little shorter than most of them, but it's still, it still walks well, floats well, I have the right ratio of everything else. So we're going to take it out fishing and we're going to see if we can catch anything with us. And now we're going to test the lure for the first time, first little cast. It actually walks really good. Probably could have distributed the weight a little better because, you know, kind of wants to flip on its side, but... For the first time building a lure, that's, uh, I mean, that's pretty good. I've heard that or not, but I'm expecting to go on the 3D lure. And as you can see, there is no more back hook on this thing. This fish just took the back hook off this lure. This was a um, 10 pound test wire doubled up and he broke it. You can see the wires right here. We, we, he just pull, pull on just broke the wire. So that had to have been a huge fish, which is just proving this lure works. This, this lure works. I mean, I'm pretty happy. This right here, he got hooked, he like jumped out of the water, hooked himself in the eye. Probably a solid four pounder, I would say, if any caught him on the spook. As you can see, the spook was doing the work today. Broke off on the 3D printed one. He hooked, we hooked a few. This is the first one did, and it's a nice one. We're gonna get away on him, and yeah. Scale, read yourself. 4.1 something ounces. Four pounds and like teen ounces, okay? That sounds That's like- That's my second biggest striper. Okay, let's get one more picture of him. Nice one right here, four, almost five pounder. I mean, almost five pounder, yeah. We're gonna give a nice release. First you see, these fish have so much energy. Oh, what the? Okay. It goes right back out of the water.
on the 3D, on the 3D lure. On the 3D lure. On the 3D lure. Yeah, but on the 3D lure. Okay, let's not, let's not have this one break me off. This is the other one I'm doing on the 3D. Okay, this guy's big. This guy's big. This guy's big. Okay. Come on. Come on. I think he might not be that big. Oh, no. He's actually pretty big. Okay. On the 3D lure. Oh, my God. Look at this rod bend. Oh, my God, guys. Look at this rod bend. Oh, dude, we got one hook in his mouth. No! Let's go! On the 3D lure! Let's go! On the 3D printed lure, guys! Four pounds, five ounces. So this is the first fish on the 3D printed lure. Nice striper. We're gonna let him go. See if we can catch another one. So if you guys want us to buy any, if you guys want to buy any, just let us know because we can sell them. So we're gonna get him a nice release here. So we just got back from kayak fishing. It's day two, and we caught one striper on the spook. This is the spook that we caught it on. Um, it's not the exact one, but it's the exact model, and we'll do another video on that later. But make sure to like this video and subscribe.